I visited a class at Goddard Middle School in Littleton, Colorado to stump them with the vanishing water trick. I have a little mystery for you. Can, and the water goes inside the can. Make sure it's not leaking out the bottom. The water's in the can, correct? Okay, now here's the scary part. The uh, card goes on top, and now we turn the whole thing upside down. Here we go. Oh, this is the scary part. Nice. And now, Samuel, I'm gonna put the whole thing on your head, like this. Good. And now I'm gonna pull the card away. Oh, no. Wait just a second. Samuel, wait, look at this. Nothing inside. It's empty. All right. Whole thing goes upside down again. Oh, I hear something inside. Are you ready? Three, two, one. And the water comes back. You think you know the trick? You think you know the trick? Yes. Figure it out. Ready? Talk. Go. So there is a, like a flap, and whenever he turns it upside down, the flap covers up the water. So whenever it's upside down, no water comes out. And when he turns it back over, the water comes out. So a little compartment that's inside? Yeah. Can I show you the secret? Yeah. All right. You can believe it or not, you can make it with uh, a soup can. Look at this. I opened up the soup can, and then I took the flap, and I pushed the flap down, and I glued around it. Ooh. I glued around the flap. So look, there's a little compartment in there. Do you see it? So now I know this much water is perfect. So when I pour it inside like this, pours in with no problem at all. But now when I turn it upside down, now the water stays hidden under the flap. <gasps> we'll get a couple drops, because that makes it kind of cool. <gasps> but the water's still there, no problem. I can do this. Got it, that's the convincer, isn't it? That looks great. And then we turn it back over. Then you do that little pass, and now the water comes back. <laughs> the secret is, don't forget to turn the cup around so that the water spills out the other side of the cup. Ta-da! Nice job.